Good guys, it's your Huggable Hipster here, and welcome back to the clumsiest hitman in the world, Huggable Hipster. I am all that is coffee consuming. Let's get into Death in the Family. We're about to go into this one. Uh, what was it? You're accessing story content before you have experienced all preceding content? But I have. What? I have. But that's what I did. You should complete Top of the World. I did complete Top of the World. What? What do you mean? I already completed that one. Let's load game to see where we were at. That's what I did. I already did this one. I already... What? Okay, I know I completed it. We're just gonna go over there. That's... That's crazy. Yes, confirm. Jeez. That's strange. That's suspicious. <laughs> Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, and you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? How are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? Oh, I like that line. I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlyle, is cold as ice, tough as nails, and sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together after the end of World War II at this very house. Meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. Oh, that's beautiful. And it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlisle keeps a case file on the constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. We're not killing her. Side. We are... What? I'm sorry, do we have to kill her? We have to go... But she's a little old lady. Why do I have to... What? I don't want to kill an old lady. Find the case file. Target Alexa Carlisle. She looks like a Resident Evil character. The Carlisle family's home for countless generations. The revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. Ooh, this is gonna be tricky. Oh, I'm up for tricky. All right, now I know why they're calling it death of the family. Find the case file, eliminate a le So we do have to kill her. Nope, I belong here. I am just a part of this area. Okay, wait a second. No, I can't vault over that. 
Darn it. Oh, okay, there's an area right over here. Oh, wait, maybe if I go in dressed as one of the guards. Now he's walking too much with a fervor, that guy. I'm just going to go in over here through the back. Oh, by the way, I told Kate about that. Go. Perfect. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, this area is beautiful. I gotta find the case file. I think something like that might be upstairs. What is it now? She scolded Mary for not making the bed the way she preferred. I don't know why I'm doing it over here like this. Just close this for a second. No, close. You guys don't know where I am. You have no idea where I am. I could be in Paraguay, okay? I could I could be in in France. Parlez-vous français? You don't know where I am? No idea. I, I could be in South Korea right now. Listen, I could also be in Mexico. Damn it, the naked man ran in! Go close the door. Oh, damn it. You get. <laughs> what I was about to say before I was so rudely interrupted by the naked man was that hiding in there, you don't know. I could be in Mexico. Hola. Mi amo es cereal. I could. Be everywhere. Priming, priming? Who's priming who? Okay, I, I need to take care of her first because I feel like she's going to be the most difficult. I mean, she already looks difficult hello, to be sir. quite honest. Oh, so you're, you're just saying hello to me. Okay, I thought you were like <laughs> telling me to beat it or something. Oh, wait, a skull. Yes, I like the way that looks. I love oddities. You know what? Fine. I listen, this is not my job. <laughs> that was so bad. First a naked man walks in on us. And, <laughs> and now this guy kill a little old lady. She doesn't look that helpless, okay? You the, the housekeeper. Yes. Me. Hi. No, I didn't want to go. Okay, fine. You know what? No, back there. Thank you. One of the maids is going to be like, what are you doing inside the closet? Oh my god. Are you like hiding in the closet? Are you hiding in there? What are you hiding from? Why is there a shot on the table? What is this? Oh my god, that's a beautiful... <gasps> is this a walk-in closet? Look at those places. <laughs> Why did I say it like that? Look at those purses. Look at those shoes. Oh my gosh, you can hate the woman all you want, but look at that collection. You would think that, you know, if you're hiding files or if you, I don't know, are being mischievous in any way with something, you, you know, you hide it up here somewhere. That's it. I've had enough of your rudeness. You know what, lady? You're really getting on my nerves right now. Leave this area immediately. There we go. Okay. That's Madame Carlyle taken care of. Time to get the fire yes. on Arthur Edwards. Okay. I can't <laughs> I can't drag the body anyway. <gasps> oh my goodness gracious. Where is something suspicious or file like or something? All right, I wasn't able to get past there before. There we go. Okay, so this might be a very file type room. Oh, no. 
I'm guessing that's her husband. Late husband? Not too sure. A laptop Zachary Carlisle bedroom showing that Zachary was shopping for Wellington boots last night. Okay. Is there something by his bedside? Nope. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Hey, there we go. We got it. Finally. Perfect. Mission Perfect. Oh, sorry about that, dude. Okay, locate the exit. Let's go. It is good to go. There we go. We are out of here. We are done. We are... We, we finished our mission. We <laughs> we got rid of an annoying old lady and um, we found case files. Which I have to say, the case files was the trickiest part of it. I have to say, like, the trickiest part of that entire mission. And I'm gonna go through over here, maybe? Yes, please? No? Thank you? Okay. Go through there, cut through over here, vault through there. 47. They're everywhere. Go, get out! It's the Constantine. Shit! There we go. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Here we go. We're good. Woo wee. That was a good mission. I like that one. That was nice. Oh, okay, so different achievements I could unlock throughout that mission. Master of the household. <laughs> nice. 40,000 XP in total. Cool. Mission time. 29 minutes and 15 seconds. Uh, that's definitely not how long it took me for that, but okay. Oh, I got a lockpick MK3. Cool. Hidden stash. Graves informant can slip in and conceal. Okay, so it's like PUBG. Great. Or not PUBG. What's that one thing where you could pretend to be, be like all the objects in the game? I forget what that game is called. Take us all on. Don't. Tell the constant to start running. Oh, no. You think you've won? 47 is out there. And 47 never misses his mark. Neither do you, Miss Burnwood. That's what makes you valuable. You're delusional. You think I would betray 47? Trust me. You owe him nothing. What is this? I told you we could help each other. And I meant it. I'll look forward to your call. Interesting. Gray is gone. Go to Berlin and stay out of sight. We're all that's left now. Jeez. I like the way the story is amping up, though. It's a, a steady, slow burn. It's pretty good. Okay, so... The next up is... Apex Predator. So, what I want to do... 
Um, do you remember final resting place? Okay, yeah, so Apex Predator is up next. I wanted to get to a save point over here, and then we're going to stop the game for today. So, um, I forget. I think this is the second to last mission, but I'll have to double check when I go back into the main menu. Oh, it just goes right into it. Okay, so we need to contact Olivia. Um, wait a second. Oh, it's a br <laughs> nice. And Olivia. Interesting. I think it goes into a save point once you walk far enough, but I'm not sure. Wait, is that German? The Spam den ganzen Sommer mit Darat? Is that German? Correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments below. I think that might be German, but I'm not sure. Oh, there's a creepy van. I think we might have found something. Okay. Something is off with this van. Why not mark van park behind a bus stop in the middle of the night? This area, for some reason, reminds me of Alan Wake. <laughs> Maybe over here? No idea. Okay. Well, this guy is just unlucky. We've been compromised. Abort and walk away now. Who? ICA. They tracked me. Don't know how. It's what they do. How many? One prime asset and a whole pack of up-and-comers. They've infiltrated the club searching for us. Chris, I think I killed one of them. Get out now before they spot you. No. They found us once. They'll find us again. <sighs> Keep your head down. I'll take care of this. Oh, wow. Oh, that music. It's so good. <laughs> Apex Predator, Berlin, Germany. I was right. It was German. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. So you guys, I'm going to end it off over here. Um, Actually, I'm going to go to menu to see how many missions there are left because I believe there's this one and then there's one other one, but I could be mistaken. Okay. So we did on top of the world. We did death in the family. We're about to do Apex Predator. So there's this one. End of an era. The Farewell. And untouchable. Okay. So there's one, two, three missions after this. Perfect. Okay. So yeah, we'll get started on the next uh, on the next mission, Apex Predator, in the next episode. I'm really excited to dive into more into this because this so far is the most enjoyable Hitman game I think I've ever played. Because I started with Hitman One, I've played the second one, and the third one so far is so good. I mean, I'm just a fan of Hitman overall. <laughs> there are a few different like bits and bobs that I'm not really so much a fan of. There's some mechanics that I don't really like, but the way that they tell a story overall, I think it's really cool. It's very simplistic. It's minimalistic and it's to the point. But you guys, if y'all like my face and what I do, please be sure to subscribe and hit that bell down below. I make videos every day here on YouTube. May you find your worth in the waking world, dear hunter. Stay casually nerdy and I will see you all in the next video. Umbasa.